Many Ghanaians and fans of Shatao Ali are calling on the state to handsomely and publicly reward him for getting featured by Beyonce on the Black is King album. The demands of these Ghanaians and diehard fans are premised on the fact that the celebrated reggae dancehall artist has worked hard to get Ghana represented on a bigger platform. According to fans, the Ghana artist feature on Beyonce album gives credence to the fact that he has worked hard and deserves to be adorned with great acknowledgement from the state. In several tweets, many believe Shatao Ali has opened the gate for the world to refocus their attention on what Ghanaian musicians and entertainers are doing differently that needs more attention and support. The hashtag state reward for Shata is being used to send the message across to people in authority, especially President Akufuado, to do the needful by honoring Shatao Ali. And joining us from Ghana is John Peter, a sound engineer and disc jockey. And also joining us is Joshua Suman Mensa, also known as RJZ. Good to have you. Let's begin with you, JP. Thank you so very much for being with us. Uh, thank you. Now, t tell us your thoughts on the first time you heard that uh, Shatawale is in Beyonce, is uh, having a collaboration with Beyonce. Well, um, Shatter has worked hard, um, born in 1985. He's even rebranded himself over the years. So Shatter's legacy spans between two generations and music. And he's claimed to call himself the African dance hall king, and he's worked hard to prove it with his... There is a clamor for Shatawale to mm -hmm. get a state award for this feature. What are your thoughts on this? Well, um, although this award, although this feature, right, this collaboration with Beyonce has reached far and wide across the borders, in my personal opinion, I don't think it deserves a state award. Um, entertainment is a large but small sector. There are other philanthropists and entrepreneurs who have built schools and hospitals, have done so much to help the nation, aside entertainment, and they haven't even been awarded a state award. So... My personal opinion, I don't think that um, this, this but, I mean, Shatawale has worked hard for it. Yes, he has a collaboration with an international artist like Beyonce, but I believe there's more to earning a state award. Mm -hmm. So All right. that's what I think. All right, lastly, African music scene is receiving a lot of recognition all over the world. You would agree with that. What's Ghana music scene like right now, if I may ask you? Well, the Ghana music scene is also bubbling. There are a lot of young artists also coming up and doing their bit. And there are other artists across Africa as well who are doing their bit as well. Artists like Tania, artists like RJZ, artists like Pepo Afro, Felimuna, Papi Pojo. There's been so many artists who are also doing a lot to also put Ghana on the map as well. And um, the older generation as well, they, they're getting older, but they're also still doing their best, also mm. push it out there. Um, speaking of someone like Shatawale, who just got the collaboration with Beyonce, there's also Stone Boy and Saka there and a bunch of others. So there is a lot of hope. I just believe that it's time for the young artists and the younger generation to be grateful for how far the industry has come and keep working at it. That's the only way it's going to push past the borders they expect to push past. All right, sound engineer John Peter, JP, thank you for your thoughts and do keep safe out there.